Hello guys, welcome to another short video on SharePoint. In this video, I'm going to show you how we can add links on the left side navigation bar of the SharePoint. Also, we can see how we can use indentation here and make groups within those links. As you can see here on the left side, we have edit links option. Currently, we don't have any links here. To add a new link, click on this one. Then you will get the link option, click on that. In the pop-up window, as you can see here, text to display, the name which you want to show it to the users, you can add it here. In this example, I will add uh, two links, one is external link. So for this example, I will take a Google website and another link that will be our uh, internal link that is, I want to link a list here. So I will take that one. First, I want to add Google, so I will just add Google. I will copy link of the Google, copy it and you come back and paste it to address. You can try this link also whether it's work fine or not. Just you can click on try link. As you can see here it is working fine. So once you are done with your testing just click on OK. You can see Google is added here. Similarly to add another link again click on link. Now I want to add a internal link that is link of a list within this site. Just copy this link here, go back to home page. Here I will name this one as test list. Then paste the link which you want to add in your quick links bar. Then click on OK. Now we can see there are two links which we have added here. Another thing which I want to add it here is like I want to categorize into external links and internal links. So for that one what I can do is I can use another link here I can give as external links then I can leave this address bar as empty then click on OK so now whatever the external link I have added so that doesn't have any link so it will act like a title in this case Google is external link I just want to bring that one under external links so just select this Google and drag it into this external links as you can see here while dragging over you can see the indentation so just leave it similarly I want to give a title for test list again I will create a new link here for this I will give title as internal links just click OK as you can see here you got another title here take this test list and drag it within this internal links so once you are done just click on save so if you mouse over on external links now, as you can see here, it's not clickable, which means we have added title only. We have not provided any link here. So that's why it works as a title. If we mouse over on Google, as we have provided link here, it works as a hyperlink or quick link for external website. So just click on that one. As you can see, website is redirecting it to the Google site. Similarly, if you come back, internal links works as a title and similarly test list that is working as a quick link here just click on that one it will redirect us to the test list what we have given there so that's it guys in this quick video thank you guys for watching this video if you like this video please click on like button share it to others and subscribe to my channel